All right, what's up guys and welcome back to Alien Isolation. I did something yesterday that I should have done 10, 15, maybe 20 years ago. I started to watch the Alien Isolation movie. Okay, I fell halfway through because I was in the pool and I got really tired. You know, the pool gets you tired sometimes. I paused it and today I will resume it, hopefully. It was absolutely fantastic. These people go to this crazy planet and this alien somehow ends up being in their ship and gets inside one of the you know crew members and comes out through his stomach and dude it was so sci-fi so freaking cool but uh i just wanted to let you guys know because you guys made me want to play this game again uh this game again and now you've made me want to watch the movie you guys have introduced i know sometimes i provide you guys with like content so you can probably kill some time or just overall you know chill out sit back or whatnot but you guys, uh, throughout the course of this channel, you guys have recommended things to me that um, I've grown the fantastic memories with. And I, I want to thank you guys. So uh, I'm excited, okay? Now, yesterday, really late, we played the Resident Evil Village demo. If you guys haven't seen it, I'll link it down below. Check it out after this video. I can't wait for that game, too. But anyways, welcome back officially to episode three. I am scared, but we're starting off the day with some sort of uh, horror Cause why not right it's sunday and uh that's what we do around here all right so we're gonna go ahead and update our map first and foremost and here we go the local departure bay okay things seem to be fine remember there was a couple of people around here that kind of ran this way into that door but that's locked now of course hello my name's Ripley, Amanda Ripley. I need your help. Please take a seat. Someone will be with you shortly. No wonder Seatson is losing the tech race. Wait, that's a fucking drone? Is that a robot? Oh, <laughs> okay. We got robots operating this. Okay. Now, by the way, I know the name of the of the individual of the main character in the movie is Ripley, but I I don't recall if her name was amanda is it supposed to be her mother the one in the movie you know i, I fell asleep a bit through the movie because i was tired again so I, I i'm gonna have to probably watch some parts of it back i was so tired but such a great movie i have to watch it back and i'm gonna finish it by all means access the rewire Okay, I don't think I need to use this for now. Is there anything here? So is this robot gonna help me or what? What the hell, dude? Okay, I don't think he's gonna do anything for me. He told me to take a seat, but I don't think he cares. I think he's just trying to waste my time. We still need that torch. So, ooh, oh. Wait, don't tell me those are more robots. No, uh, Ripley, put put that away, sister. What are you doing? Okay, this is the coolant maintenance. By the way, I was watching the movie and I felt like I was actually playing the game. That's how close the game was made to the movie. It was actually quite fascinating to see what a great job, you know, the devs did with this game. I read somewhere that they were uh, like really big fans of this game, like the developers. So that's why this game is so, so close to the actual movie. Like the ship and the components and just overall the vibe, the music is like the same. It's super cool. And hello there, dude. I don't like this. Can I help you? I need to get into comms control. It's urgent. That is a restricted area. It's an emergency. Don't you realize what's going on? Apollo has the situation in hand. Your registration is almost complete. Forget it. I'll find my own way in. Okay, I wouldn't advise it. Stinking robot. Bro, you are creepy. What is wrong with you? Aren't you supposed to be doing maintenance or something? Why are you over there just looking? Okay, you turned around. Good. I will be on my way now. Thank you, sir. 
I have a feeling we're going to get screwed here. Every door is locked. We haven't really found anything. But of course, we will continue. We shall obey. We got some scrap here. Hold on. Let me see if I can... Um, let me see if I can mix something. Maybe make another med kit. Craft a med kit. And what else do we have here? A smoke bomb. Maybe I can craft a smoke bomb. Okay, craft the item. And then now we have a flashbang. No. Perfect. Motion tracker. Some kind of tracker. Oh my god. It's been modified. Oh my god. Oh, what the fuck? Is there a problem? No, no problem. Yo, that is creepy. What is wrong with these drones, dude? Collect scrap. Okay, hold on. Scrap, scrap. Uh... Okay, let's see if we can make something else here. Can I collect scrap? Bonding agents. Access terminal. I'm really enjoying this game, by the way. I, I really am. So, Hughes, uh, this is the door override. I've put a manual lock onto the door leading upstairs. Don't want any accidents until we figure out what's on here. Uh, what's going on here? The chief. So, here we've got an error. Bad file. Our manifested first published in the Ion season, uh, February 2115. Yeah, so the movie takes place, I believe, in 2037 or something like that. Um, so I think this is after the movie. We don't want to show you, <clears throat> we don't want to show you a new world. We want to discover it with you. Here at Seekson, every new technology research project and discovery is driven to find real world applications to help you. We hope you'll join us for the journey. Tomorrow, together, number one. Uh, together, uh, together tomorrow, Seekson's journey into the colonial space of official history by Sebastian Siege, first printed in Eye on Seekson. Seekson? Seekson? I don't even know how to pronounce that. Our origins in space. In 2034, uh, everything changed. Uh, the advent of faster than light travel put Seekson, the known, um, known as Siege and Sun. So I'm just going to call it Siege, okay, on the path to success. The race into space began... Um, in earnest, and under the steady hand of our founder, Josea Siege, uh, our company was primed and ready for the years that followed. Siege and Sun built the components that enabled ships to extend colonial space beyond the solar system. Solar system. Um, as history relates, Wayland Corp. was reluctant to share the FTL technologies with other corporations. Fortunately, Josea Siege was on hand to speculate, innovate, and produce. Without Siege and Sun... The skies would have looked very different indeed. Marie, if you get this, I'm making my way to Seeks and Communications now. I didn't wake you because I knew you'd try and stop me. Please understand, this is our best shot. Someone's got to reestablish communications. We need to make sure the officials back at home know what's going on here. Don't worry about me, I'll be back. I'm not going to leave you and Claire alone. Oh, we just overrid the uh, doors. Uh, are they gonna like this? Okay, fuck it. This is we're not even want. This is restricted territory. Wow, look at that, huh? Okay, so now we've got a new... Oh, what is that? Now we've got a new tool in our hands. <laughs> which is going to make the game even more terrifying. You know what's worse? It makes the background blurry. That is terrifying. Sometimes it's better not to know what's coming, you know? Just, just let it happen. Don't tell me he's coming because then I get all anxious and stuff.
Oh my god, I don't like this. Okay, can I go here? The marker on the edge of the motion tracker. Okay. Screen to your next objective. Oh, is that what that is? Oh, cool. Okay, perfect. I thought that marked the enemies. Probably, it probably still does. Maybe it gives us both. We are now here. Can I take a hot shower? No. A flare. I will take the flare. Do not think about that. Oh, another, why are we getting so many flares? I don't like this. Okay, what is this? Nose maker. You know what? Let me stop that. View in the radio menu. Blueprint. What is that? Nose make noise make oh my nose maker <laughs> noise maker God I am such a fool Alright That's uh to create distraction of course Yes. Oh. Okay, so we came all the way from over there. Did we check here? Okay, perfect. So that door's unlocked. Uh. Uh oh. There's a drone right there. There's another drone over there. Oh, what the fuck? The charge pack. Wait, what? Are these are these robots gonna do anything crazy? What's going on here? Uh. Nice, yo, I like that. That is so cool. can't trust anybody okay we're in the middle of freaking space we're being handed a bunch of freaking flares and batteries and now we got drones all of a sudden i don't know what's going on here let me pass it's me hughes don't you recognize me? Listen to me. We've got to re-establish long-range communications. You're becoming hysterical. Get back! I'm warning you! Tut, tut. Let's resolve this amicably. That's the guy we just read about. He just smashed his freaking brains in. What is going on here? Now these fucking killer drones. Okay, can I? Okay, I'm nerd. Ooh, ooh. Oh my god, this game just gets crazier. Thank Gain access to the elevator, avoid detection. Oh, that's just fucking great. Okay, so we can't... Freaking lord. I'm 
so sorry. Ah! Oh! What the fucking shit, you stupid! Oh my god, what is happening here? Holy smokes! My god, this game just keeps getting better and better. <laughs> oh shit. Let's go. Okay, so your logged message. Cannot access the Okay, sensitive corporation information has been automatically detected in the Sevast link. Message recently sent from this terminal. This event has been logged by Apollo. And on behalf of Siege. If you have any further questions, please talk to your line manager on your nearest synthetic Siege and representative. Or your nearest representative so Riggs are you still working down at siege communications remember the trouble that you got into last year the trouble I helped you out of well it's time to repay the favor one of our colleagues has been looking uh, has been looking into some of the import documents and found a few problems he's new so he doesn't understand how we do things on uh, Sevastopol and he's threatening to go uh, to wait about it uh, this could hurt us all, so I need to keep an eye on him. I'll see if anything interesting comes up. Apollo has cameras everywhere. It just needs some. I just need. It just needs someone to tell it where to point to. His name is Daniel Halden. He lives in. Jo he lives in Jose Josea Sig Executive Apartment Six Five One. Um, if this goes well, I might have some more work for you. We could clean up here. Ra ran ransom, ransom. Or the corrupted utility. <laughs> okay, so can I disable the maybe the camera I can disable it? Injectors. Another ID tag. I know we're supposed to go back to the door, but just making sure maybe there's not something here that we can kind of pick up on. A lot of it could just be decorative, but you never know. 
Oh, that's the other drone. Holy crap. He went. Remember we were around here? He went all the way around. Holy crap. I hate how I had to re reload every single time. I mean, it actually feels quite realistic. I think I wasted some bullets back there, too. You're always knowing. Uh, you always know a working Joe. Ooh. Camera feed. Another flare. Thank you. You see, so like if you don't really search thoroughly, you can miss stuff, man. Very easily. So the cameras are off. Calling the elevator. Come on. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're in, boys. We are in there. Like swimwear to comms control. Oh god. Oh god. Just gonna pull out my little handy dandy tool. Just in case. Oh. Central Communications Hub seeks an employees only. See, one of the most fascinating. stupid robots everywhere are you kidding me i was just gonna say one of the most fascinating things about this game is the music i love it when that beat drops man it's intense fucking intense okay so we have a couple of ways that we can go about this so all right so we're supposed to go should i go through the top should i stay or should i go no access. What is this? I will take me that. Thank you. Ooh. Okay, so we've got uh, a thing that looks like an E. Perfect. We have officially hacked into the Sevastopol link. Personal Torrens Hail. This is the commercial vessel Torrens out of St. Clair. Registration number MSV7760. Calling Sevastopol traffic control. We're carrying three passengers on a Wayland Yutani bond. You're holding the Nostromo flight recorder units. We request immediate permission to transfer the passenger's port side. Over. Let's head up here and see what's up. Oh, look at this. External communications disabled by order of Apollo. Facility offline. All outgoing communications halted. Oh, that's just great. Internal communications open on limited channels. Gotta be someone in the station I can contact. Fucking hell. Find an alternate communications terminal. What happens if I air purification? I think I should leave that on, but I'm gonna be crazy and turn it off. Let's see. Maybe I have to turn it off. Maybe that way I can go in through here. I don't know. 
having off the uh, air purif purification doesn't sound smart, but playing this game is not very smart. Hold LT to focus vision while you're holding. Oh, you can swap. What? He's over there straight ahead. Is there a way we can sneak behind these drones and just kill them? There's a drone right there. Look at that planet, bro. That is so cool. One of them is moving. Wait, can I go in through here? side of the map observatory chamber okay we need a torch 
feel like once we unlock that torch, there's going to be a bunch of new things that we're going to be able to interact with. A lot of these doors um, are only operatable. Or I guess you can only open them. Force open them with a torch, so. Intel Communications Nerd is... Okay, let me, let me go in here. Dude, I only got five bullets, man. This is no bueno. Hold on. I will respond in just a jiffy. I'm just... You know, I'm kind of having... One second, bud. I'm having a hard time here. I'm just... Let me make sure there's nothing here and that I will reply right now. Just, just hold on tight. Bro, I need help. What are you talking about? charge pack here the smoke bomb needs a charge pack no it doesn't anything that I have here that needs a charge this needs a charge pack perfect the noise maker all right thank you sir Where was this thing coming from? Oh, we just went around. All right, we just went around. So let's go back this way. I can't hear those people speaking over the uh, radio anymore, though. Gotta be very careful before the drone comes back. But I do want to make sure that we're not missing anything essential here. Especially now that we're extremely low on freaking bullets. With these freaking drones. Alright, the communication center's gotta be here. Here it is. What? 34 plus 34 equals 68. Oh, I see. You gotta press up on the D-pad. Samuels! You're alive! It's Ripley! Ripley! Taylor, it's Ripley. We were getting worried. We I thought... made it! Where are you? Uh, we're at a transit station now. It's right by medical. Okay. Samuels, listen to me. It's not safe here. Siegson's got this place locked tight. Their goddamn androids are killing people. That's impossible. It's contrary to primary synthetic programming. I've seen it, Samuels. I guess Siegson's got a different idea about synthetics. And there's something else here. A creature. It's big and it's lethal. Ripley, slow down. A creature. 
It's a life form, a, an unknown type, some kind of alien organism. It's extremely dangerous. You and Taylor Ripley, need to make- Taylor is hurt. She was injured by debris during the crossing. How bad? I can't move her. I need medical supplies. We need to treat and pack the And injury. the Torrens? The radio is broken. I can't contact Verlaine. We're on our own. Shit. Okay. I'll come to you. Keep your eyes open. I'll send a transit card here. Unauthorized communication. Please wait to be attended by a member of Sikhs and personnel. We will be with you momentarily. Shit. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? Turn off the alarm. Um, there's a drone right there. Oh. Oh my God. This is uh, Wayland Yutani, Executive Administration, Nina Taylor, confirming the receipt of your transmission. I'm a member of the team assigned to collect an Osmos flight recorder. The black box in your possession is of primary importance to Wayland Yutani. Under existing corporate agreements, we should remind you that you must not attempt to uh, read its, con its contents, nor disclose its presence to any third parties. We will be with you soon. A private message. Marshall Waste. Uh, Sebastopol, this is Wayland Yutani, Executive Administration, Nina Taylor. I'll let her say it. the Nostromo flight recorder. The black box in your possession is of primary importance to Wayland Utani. Under existing corporate agreements, we should remind you that you must not attempt to read its contents, nor disclose its presence to any third parties. We'll be with you soon. A private message from Marshal Waits will follow. Okay. Access this. Let's see if we can turn off the alarms. I don't know why it's not. Not sure what the hell is going on here. Let's go. Let's go in through here. Sight. I like it. Okay, we're headed this way. Oh, what the fuck? Hello? What is happening here? Coming this way? <gasps> oh, what the fuck 
fucking oh shit! Why are these drones so damn strong? This is ridiculous. Fuck it, I'm gonna keep smashing it. I'm not wasting my revolver bullets. Okay, now he's got he's got me. Oh fuck, I just got bitch slapped. Oh, oh there goes there goes my fucking ammo. God, I hate these stupid ass drones, man. Okay, this was locked before, wasn't it? Oh, that drone did not see me. This game, it, it's not only scary, but it's very, very interesting. It's got a, such a good story, bro. Like, I'm blown away by this story. It's actually fascinating how good this story is. These poor bastards, bro. Oh, well, that poor bastard. Oh, fuck. I don't have any more uh, revolver ammo, so I don't know what I'm gonna do. If the shit hits the fan, we're we're screwed. We are absolutely screwed if the shit hits the fan. I'm gonna save up real quick, cause you know you just never know, bro. These drones are out of control right now. They're, they're trying to take my head off. But I would not let them. My name is Ripley, and I am the protagonist of this game. You are my world, biatch. Kidding me? I gotta get past this idiot. I don't know how I'm gonna get past this guy. What 
just happened? Oh. <gasps> to laugh is to... Yes. Oh, he's moving. There's the alien moving. Oh my god, that's crazy. Oh fuck, he's coming. Okay, this is ridiculous. I literally have to worry about this fucking drone now. And then I've got an alien on top of the vents. Will this stupid drone just get out of here already? Okay, I think we're good. Oh my god, this is nerve-wracking. Oh god. What the fuck, bro? So what is my objective right now? Take transit to the scheme. T Where is this? Okay. Oh, we're back here. Oh, I saw him. Oh, he moves quick, bro. That's going to cause... Major unwanted attention. I need to save this game like right, like yesterday. Flippin' Lord, I can't even hide it. Oh, no, 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 no. This is no bueno. Yo, this is actually terrifying. I gotta watch out for those vents on the roofs, man. I keep forgetting that that's where he can snatch you from.
Cervix seeks in communication technologies. Check support. All right, rewire this crap. Exoplanet Solutions. Remind me why I agreed to this contract. Not. Oh, that's not good. Is that where I'm supposed to go? Oh my flippin' god. Dude. Okay, so the EMP devices can be used to disable the droids. I didn't know. Do we have any EMPs? That's good. Ripley? Is that Ripley? Of course. Try and rest, Taylor. How is she? She needs treatment. Medical's nearby, but I didn't want to leave her. I'll go and investigate. See what I can find. You stay with her. I'll try to repair the radio booster. What if this creature shows up? <laughs> and we're fucked. Hide. Unauthorized security breach detected. All transit shut down by order of Apollo. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I'm gonna go over here. I'm, I'm, yep. There's little time to waste, Ripley. Oh, I, I know, man. Believe me. Trust me. You don't know what I've seen. I've seen killer androids, killer aliens. Look at that. I can't even save a game. <laughs> it's been pretty bad out here, Chief. Sorry I'm telling you right now. Ripley's finding help. I will attempt to find help. All right, guys. We're going to end it here. It's It's been one hell of an episode, dude. This game is so good. I've heard of people play this game like five, ten times. I've heard of a dude that has over like 150 hours in this game, which I don't know how you could do that. Um, but that's how good the game is, right? So anyways, we'll end it here. Thank you so much for watching. This story is fascinating. It's not just about the horror and the tension. It's the story, the, the, the environment. It's what makes this game special. So I hope you guys are enjoying it. As always, of course, if you are, drop it a like. That means that you guys want more episodes and I'll bring you more episodes. So uh, yeah, hopefully I'll catch you on the next one.